All right, we got another rap man. It's called Promise. All right, so we're gonna see what rap man. This was almost 10 minutes, so this is probably gonna be a real good story coming from rap man, you know what I'm saying? That boy got some storytelling abilities straight up. Straight up. So let's go ahead and check out Promise by Rap Man. And. And here we go. But if he's cute and he's got money, keep him. <laughs> cute, you got money, keep him. That's the problem, Joe. Ooh, she is built. <laughs> you look crazy. I like that one. Yeah, that one's nice. Yeah. She is built. Ooh, look at that. Look at him. How do I look? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, excuse me, can I talk to you quickly, please? Okay. Hey. Yeah, I was talking about your friend over there. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because oh. I know you're a gold digger. Her. <laughs> Sarah, he wants you. Me? Well, he can come out his car if he wants to talk to me. Playing hard to get. See the way my car is parked, I'll probably get a ticket, so can I take your number and call you later? I'll take your number. Probably she's going to call me. I promise. Okay, she got some morals, I like that. A promise is just a word. Very true, promise is just a word. In case you missed that. A promise is just a word. There's gotta be action behind that word to make it mean that word. Promise, it doesn't always work. Sometimes it's nothing more than the work. Yo, the day Sarah met Davin was the day she fell in love. She just turned 18, he just turned 21. He was kind and polite, plus he had a nice car. All the girls there were on him, but that day he chose her. Her exes were both the same age as her. She always felt they weren't on the same page as her. She's mature with a load of ambition. Uni next year to be a pediatrician. Davin's doing well with IT technician. Swear she couldn't find a better man if she wished him With him six days, seven days, she'll still miss him Her last thing was popular, but this thing was different It's full grown, still together one year on Happier than ever in the place they both call home Then one day everything could change She came to find out she had the baby on the way When she told Darren he was over the moon And yeah, she was scared, but she was happy too So that having a baby, and yeah, that's great, right? But let me show you how the baby changed the whole life It's like the minute she was pregnant, Davin got obsessive From sweet and polite to abusive and aggressive First she put it down to being overprotective Soon she figured out he was just being jealous She never understood though, to her it was crazy A grown man jealous of her unborn baby So used to having all of her attention but with the baby on the way, he could barely get a mention So he does things just to make her feel bad She dressed up to go out, he said she looked like a slut Alright babe, Shan's here I'll message you when I get to the club, yeah? Oh, Paul. Where are you going? To the club. Where is this? Yeah, why? Well, what's wrong? Get changed. Change why? I look fine. Yeah, change your clothes. Why, though? My skirt isn't even that short. Go and get changed why? now. My she can skirt? wait. No, I don't have time to change. You look like a slapper. A slag. I look like a what? You look like a slag. A slag. Go and get changed. You look like a slag. Are you kidding me? Right? Now. God, what's a slag? Now. No, I'm not. Now. I look fine as now. I am right now. Thank so you. Go and change your clothes. You're not listening to me. Now go and change your clothes now. He told her to change. She said she didn't want to. He grabbed her by the throat and then he told her that she has to. She couldn't believe it. She was so scared. He used to make her feel safe. Now he makes her feel fair. She deserves better. And so does the child. So she packs up and leaves him alone in the house. She was gone for a week or so. Then Davin pleaded that he just lost control. He promised he would never ever do it again. 
And things will be different if she comes back home So she went back and things were good But it didn't take long before it turned to bad Wherever she went, he would have to go And if he ever couldn't make it, no he's keeping the time He liked to keep track of every move she made Who she spoke to and their names as well And a phone call that wasn't nearly enough She had to FaceTime so we could see for himself But one day she took a walk to the shops A battery died with no place to charge it Yeah she tried to explain herself But he was so mad he just couldn't see past it He kept asking her where she was And she kept saying that she went to the shops But damn him I didn't believe it He grabbed her by the throat then it all kicked off Then he grabbed her hair then he smacked her face Man he hit her so hard that she fell to the ground And then he slowly leaned over her body And he continued to beat her down oh, By the time that one finally stopped Sarah's face that was a beaten mess That was the day Sarah left the house And she promised she would never step foot in again never go back. Three months on and six months pregnant Sarah she's been living back home with her mum But her mum works 55 hours a week So more time she's alone with the bump And Darren's calling every day saying that he misses her Flowers and excuses to apologize for hitting her And even though she knows what he done was bad She starts thinking it's her actions that made him mad no, Like maybe no, if she no, charged no. her home Maybe if she stayed at home Like maybe if she didn't do what he would've liked Then maybe he would've kept control Before Darren started work. begging forgiveness He went and told Sarah that she was a mess He told her no guy wants a girl with a next man's kid And that she's worthless and born in bed Them words there, they hurt more than a beating All her insecurities were breaking through Raising a baby alone in her mother's front room Is not something she aspired to do And she ain't even got friends she can open up to A crazy ex diamond part entered that He told her that her best friend tried to make a move on him And that she can't trust a girl like that He could have been lying, but she believed it She locked her friends off and now she's standing alone She hates being lonely, man, it's making her sad And she ain't really trying to bring a baby up on her own Despite it all, she still loves Dabby She knows it's not perfect, it's far from that But this time he made the promise on their unborn child It would be different if she takes him back oh. So she took the chance and she went back It didn't matter that her mother didn't want her to go She made her own choice and she's glad she did Cause now things were even better than they were before No more violence and no more abuse There was nothing but love whenever he came home She was his queen and he was a king And their little baby boy would be the heir to the throne One day everything could change though Damon went out and left his phone behind Now Sarah couldn't help herself But she wasn't quite prepared for what she happened to find It turned out that Damon's been cheating And not just now but the whole of the time See that was that Her backs were packed Cause she'd rather be alone than to live in a life With her heart fully broken she's ready to leave And at the very same point that's when he walks in She confronts him straight and says her heart's in pain And that she never in her life would have done that to him Said it's not his fault She should blame herself It was our own risk to go and search his phone She can't take no more and heads towards the door But he blocks her in the path to stop letting her go He told her that the day you was pregnant with my child From that day there you belong to me See I allowed you to walk out them last two times But this time I ain't letting you leave She screamed out Darren I hate you She tried to push past him to get to the door But Darren didn't take too kindly He grabbed her by the throat like he's done before But this time Sarah she fought back Yeah she tried the best to throw slaps and kicks But all that did was add fuel to the fire Cause he responded with a tighter grip Sarah couldn't Bro. fight no more The grip was so strong, everything turned hazy And with her last final inch of breath She uttered the words, please don't hurt our baby But Davin was in such a rage That he barely paid attention to the words she said He couldn't believe it That she dared put her hands on him So right now all he sees is red With all of his strength, he was squeezing the neck You would think he was trying to dislocate her head He finally calmed down and put his hands down But it was too late, cause Sarah was dead Oh, bro Hot two. Uh, hold on. Hold the F on. How many? Two women every week are killed by a partner or ex partner in England. Two women every week?
two women every week. I'm acting like that's a lot. I don't even know how many die here. It's probably more than that. What is wrong with niggas, man? What is wrong with these niggas? What is wrong with them, bro? You don't need to hit a woman. You don't need to. If a woman wants to be... I mean, you don't need to. Always insecure. All these insecure dudes out here feel like the only way they can keep a woman is through fear. That's not how you keep anything. Nothing will stay with fear. You can beat a dog. It will eventually snap and try to bite you to protect itself. Eventually, it will do it. You can't do that, man. Unborn child, bro. Choked out. Dumbass. Now you're getting two counts of murder. Two. Two counts of murder. Well, does it work that way in the UK? I know here you're getting two counts of murder. If a woman's pregnant, you kill her, it's two counts of murder. Two. You're getting two of them. I don't know how it works there. Man, that was crazy. Man, that was crazy. Man, that was crazy. Man, that's going to do it for this reaction. Rap man, storytelling with the videos to match, which is crazy, man. Which is just crazy. I'm going to check out a lot more rap, man. Yeah, I like that. I really, really do. But that's going to do it for this reaction. Is that true? Like, do you get two counts of murder if you kill a pregnant woman in the UK? Y'all let me know down in the comments below. And I am Nixon.